everyone. It's Mark Rhodes with New View Strategies. It is time, that's right, for another three questions with today. We're talking to Cynthia Preby. Hi, Cynthia. Hello, everybody. I cannot believe this. I think we're coming up on a year that you've been working with us at New View Strategies already. Can you believe that? I can't, but it's been a great year. Yes. Fantastic. Despite everything that's happening, we've been uh, we've yeah. been having a very good year. We've been very blessed with that. If you've not watched the three questions with before, it's just a fun little way of getting to know some of the community leaders in our wonderful Dynamics Nav and Central community. And I post three questions to whoever I'm talking to or whoever I can grab to answer three questions. And so, Cynthia, are you ready to dive in? I'm ready. Fantastic. All right. So. I know you've been a fixture in the community for a long time. Anybody that knows you knows that you are so deeply passionate about Dynamics Nav, about Business Central, and more importantly, helping others and just sharing your experience. Why is that? Well, I got to go back a little ways. I've been working with ERP systems since 1999 and was introduced to Nav in 2005. And at first was a little intimidated by it, but then realized, oh my gosh, this system is so powerful. And from 2005 on, I've had the, the luxury, I think of it, as working with a lot of different users and companies and the different ways that they use the system. And I would always get frustrated when someone would call me up frustrated and think they needed a customization when what they needed to do was built right into the system. So I realized at that point, it's time to share, time to get excited about it. And every time I talk to somebody, I try to figure out a way for them to use the system better. And I've been able to do that. And when you have success, you feel good about it. Oh, there's nothing better than sharing some little trick that seems like such a nothing, right? But it mm -hmm. means such a difference uh, with somebody who's using the system, especially every day, if they can save that time, that frustration uh, multiple times a day even, right? Is it makes all the difference in the world. I love seeing the reaction. I, and I think that's really what helps drives you, right? It absolutely does. And it doesn't yeah. seem to matter how long they've been using the system. True. Sometimes it's because they were never taught something. Other times it's because they forgot something. Right. Right. And um, I don't know. It just kind of makes my day. <laughs> yeah. Excellent. All right. So uh, one of the things I've noticed is you talk a lot about doing things in the system the writer way, which I just <laughs> I love that expression. But what does that mean? Well, um, just as I've indicated, there are lots of things that we can do in NAV and Business Central, and a lot of people aren't aware of them. And over the years, working with different companies and different ways of using the system, I have found that if somebody says, oh, here's how I'm using orders and invoices for my process, it might be completely different from the next person that I speak to about it. Right. 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 So what I really enjoy is kind of combining what I've kind of already alluded to where somebody's thinking there's got to be a better way. But, you know, they're using orders in their invoicing. Well, when I'm talking to them, I said, well, let's dig into this a little deeper because mm -hmm. there's more than one way to do things in this system. And maybe we can find a writer way for you. Yeah. Yes. And there usually is, right? <laughs> usually, not always, um, but usually there is, yes. Part of the fun is, is mm -hmm. all the different ways you can accomplish the same thing, yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Hey, third question, I always like to do something a little bit more personal. Uh, for folks who don't know, Cynthia has been involved with horses and not just a, boy, I like horses and she's got a calendar up on the wall, but really involved with horses uh, for a good portion of her life. Um, it used to show horses, uh, ride them, of course, raise them. And um, in particular, Cynthia, we spent a long time talking about that, but what's something you've learned in working with horses that you apply to, to life in general? Am I allowed to say damn? <laughs> <laughs> I guess I just did, right? Um, the best way to illustrate it, and I'll I'll make it short, and uh, anyone else who knows me knows I like to talk, and when you combine my love of talk and horses, we're in trouble. Um, but basically, I was 
very early on, 20 some years ago, and I was working with a trainer and I was riding my horse uh, in a, a session where it was training me and the horse. And I was so deeply concentrating on what I was doing, where my legs were, where my hands were, whether my chin was up. And I heard this voice in the background getting louder and louder. And it was my name. And I realized it was my instructor. And she said, get to the middle of this ring. And I rode my horse over into the middle of the ring. And I looked at her and she said, oh, my gosh, Cynthia, you, you were just worrying too much. You were overanalyzing everything. You're taking it apart way too much. You know what you need to do? You need to just ride the damn horse. You need you've thought this through just enjoy yourself and ride the damn horse and I'll tell you what whether it's an implementation or a special feature or functionality that someone's trying to implement or they're just trying to figure out where they want to go with their organization and technology you can become paralyzed by analysis yes. and sometimes you right. just have to ride the damn horse what a great saying I definitely can see that on T-shirts and bumper stickers. You, you <laughs> should go ahead and <laughs> crowdsource a business, get that going, I think. <laughs> I, I'm not sure about, I guess maybe sometimes I could say darn horse, but um, yes, I, I, I'll i tell you what, it changed my life. And and I have shared this many a time um, on a call or in a conference. And it accomplishes a couple of things. It causes whoever's in the middle of that stressful thought that caused me to think of that uh, to laugh and then yeah. additionally to realize that maybe we were taking this too seriously and we just need to make a decision to move forward. There you go. There you go. Keep it all in perspective. Exactly. Excellent. Hey, Cynthia, I know you got a really busy week ahead of you, so I really appreciate you spending just a couple minutes with us and getting to know Cynthia a little bit better. Thank you. And thanks for being on the NewView team. Thank you, everybody. Everyone, we'll have another three questions with very soon. Keep checking our YouTube channel. Hey, a better idea, just go ahead and subscribe and then we'll let you know when we put another video out there. And be sure to check out our blog as well. Um, Cynthia and uh, my other colleagues have been writing a lot about the newest release of Business Central, which came out just a couple of weeks ago. And you can check that out and see what their favorite features and enhancements are. Until next time, thank you very much. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Thank you.